you're part of a robotics team, your off season is the ultimate opportunity to transform and get ahead of the game. And here's why you shouldn't ignore it. I'm Coach Pratt, and with over a decade of robotics teaching experience and having coached national champion and Inspire award-winning FTC teams, I know the impact of a strategic off-season prep. Last season, one of my teams went from dead last in our region, followed this plan, and came out as national champions. In this video, we're diving into five essential areas you need to focus on to make your off-season successful. Communication, building and CAD skills, programming, marketing, and documentation. Let's get you geared up to make your next season your best year. Tournament ends and you don't get into the next round, or world is over and you're not headed over to a premier battle. Why now? Well, it's officially off season, and this is just as important, if not more, than the competition season itself. It's time to build, learn, and improve. So let's talk about some of the ways you can use your time wisely to set your team up for success next season. First, let's talk communication. If you want to get ahead next season, you need to be able to work together. Start by creating realistic timelines for your team. I'm talking about planning backwards by weeks, so you know exactly what needs to be done and when. Don't forget to build in buffer time for those unexpected delays. One method that's worked well for us is having daily scrums, where you answer two simple questions. What did you do last time? And what are you doing today? This keeps everyone on the same page and ensures that nothing gets missed. Try to use Kanban boards, and one for each area of focus. A build, a software, marketing, and learning. Assign specific tasks for each member so that everyone knows their role and stays on track. Next up is build team. If you want to get ahead next season, this is the time to level up your skills. For builders, learn or improve your CAD skills. This is one of the most crucial skills for FTC. Check out my tutorials on Fusion 360 if you haven't done so already. If you're already comfortable with CAD, how about designing a custom drive tray for the next competition? Even if you don't plan to use it immediately, this will get your team thinking about design early and help you get ready for the summer build season. For rookies or new members, build a separate bot on a test chassis. This will help you not only understand the basics of assembly, motors, and the design process, but to do so without the pressure of the full competition robot. Now let's talk to the programmers. The off-season is a great time to improve your coding skills and get familiar with more advanced driving techniques. If you haven't done so already, start practicing field-centric driving. It's a game changer. If you're feeling ready to take things to the next level, work on autonomous pathing with Roadrunner or Pedro pathing, and use some dead wheel odometry. This is key for auto points and can be that big edge in those competitions. The more you practice now, the smoother your robot is going to run when it counts. The off-season is also an ideal time to focus on your team's marketing and outreach. The best teams give back to their community. And this isn't just about recognition. It's about making an impact. Support a first Lego League team or run robotics clubs at local elementary schools. Get involved with your local first community. Help with events, mentor other teams, share your knowledge. Not only does this help others, but it also raises your team's profile, which can be important when it comes time to apply for grants, sponsorships, or just building your team's reputation. And finally, you document everything. Every project, every milestone, every outreach event you do in the off-season can help with awards like Inspire or other gestures. Take photos, write up updates, and keep track of your team's progress. Inspiration, innovation, and outreach are all things the judges love to see and having a solid documentation process will set you up for success come next competition. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more robotics tutorials. And remember, the off season is more than just a break. It's a chance to prepare, learn, and set yourself up for success. Whether it's improving communication, learning new skills, or engaging with community, everything you do now counts towards next season's success. If you got any more questions or ideas for future videos, make sure to drop them in the comments down below. And good luck. I hope to see you out there next season.